Oh my goodness. When I say these words in the beginning of the video, it means something really significant has happened. What you see here right now is me playing Stray in virtual reality in my Quest 3. Yes, the 2D game Stray. And all this is possible thanks to the Preydog Universal Unreal Engine VR mod. With this mod, you can play thousands, and I mean it, thousands of PC games in VR and it works like a charm. It is incredible and it's a game changer for PC VR. In this video, I'm going to show you step by step how easy and simple it is to use the mod and to play all these Unreal Engine 4 and 5 games in VR in your Quest or in any other VR headset. So absolutely stay tuned, watch the whole video because all of this goodness is coming up. Hi and welcome back to the channel. My name is Sebastian Ang and wow, what an unbelievable start into the year 2024. This is so important for PC VR. Suddenly we can play hundreds of AAA titles with our Quest 3, our Quest 2, any VR headset basically. Thanks to Predox Universal Unreal Engine mod. And it's so simple to play all these games. All the other Unreal Engine 4 and 5 games. And most of them simply work out of the box. So, let's get into it. Let me show you how exactly make this happen. You simply go to uevr.io. This is the website of the project and you can learn about the project and read lots of material about it if you want, but you want to download it. Go to GitHub, click on this button and here you'll see the GitHub repository. So you want to go to releases since you want to download it. Click on UEVR initial beta release. Probably it's going to be called something else uh, when you watch this video in the future. And well, here it is. UE four and five games can be played in VR. Incredible. Just looking for the download. Here it is. Click on that link and you're going to download that zip file to your computer. You need to unzip it, right? And I did it here for you already. And then here it is. The UEVR injector dot exe this is the file that you need to run and this is the actual mod now here what i'm showing you here right now is how you connect steam link with your quest 3 or quest 2 in order to wirelessly connect your quest with your pc so i've made a video you can check it out here all right once you've done that then you, yeah your vr headset will be available for this mod for example and for all the games you want to play but now finally, let's learn how to play a game in VR. So the first thing that you have to do is you start the injector app here, uvrinjector.exe. So you double click on it, then it starts. Probably you have to restart it as administrator if you didn't directly start it as administrator. So I'm doing it here and then it's going to restart, do that. Once you've done that, you have many options that at this moment in time are not so important yet, right? First, start the game. So I open the Steam, Steam app and I start Stray here. And Stray is going to start on your desktop now. Here it is. It's an amazing game and you should absolutely play it. In 2D it's great, in VR it's unbelievable. So then you go back here and here from the process list, you choose the game. In this case, it's Stray. Yes, here it is. And now you would have many options, but in this tutorial, we don't go into these options, but click on inject, that's important. Click on inject and then the magic is going to happen and the mod is going to inject this whole thing into virtual reality. And in your VR headset, now you will see the game. And let's move over to my Quest 3 recording. Here it is. This is now in VR. And as you could tell, also in VR, you have all these options that you could change, right? So there's many, many things that you can do, but for this beginner tutorial, I'm not going to go into them. And here you are. Stray in VR, even the menu looks so cool. It is incredible. And now let's start the game. Here we are. 
It feels like magic to be in this game. It's so beautiful. I enjoyed it when I played it in 2D, but being here in this beautiful, crazy, cyberpunkish world, wow. It is so good. So get it while you can in the Steam winter sale. So yeah, big, big recommendation. And what is cool, you can completely play this game with your VR controllers. So right now, actually, I'm using my Quest 3 controllers. They have done a fantastic mapping that would make it feel like you are holding a controller, a standard game controller, right? So that works really well. Probably you don't have like all the keys, like the D-pad, for example, but there's some workarounds and well, read all the manuals. They will exactly tell you how to do it. And in the end of this video, I'm going into this for a moment, right? About the documents where you can find them and so on. So it's so unbelievable. You have now thousands of games at your disposal. Again, all the Unreal Engine 4 and 5 games, you can play them. But of course, not every game will work as well as Stray, right? Because of, yeah, well, the game mechanics and so on and so forth. So the community has thought about it, the Prey Dog community. And wow, look at this. They have made a list of all the games that work well and don't work well. So check out this incredible list. So I have to give it up to the community, to the Prey Dog mod community. Check this out. They went through all these games, they checked them out, they made videos about it, and it is just mind-boggling. This is so cool. It's the end of the time when people said like, oh, VR, there's no games for it. No, this is such a game changer. Really, it's a game changer. There's so many games now, I don't even know where to start. So, wow. Big respect to Prey Dog and the community for making this happen. Thank you. The whole VR community should thank Prey Dog and the team. Yeah, also, this, um, this file... I'm going to link it down in the description of this video. It's fantastic. You will also see all the Steam Winter Sale. And today is the last day that you can actually yeah, buy these games for so cheap. So check it out. The link is in the description of this video. At the end of this video, I want to talk about one thing. If you are as grateful as I am, why don't you support PreyDog on PreyDog's um, Patreon page? At the moment, there's only 498 people that would support Prey Dog with only 5 euros. So I am one of those 500, but come on, shouldn't this at least be like 1,000 or more? So if you play at least one game with this engine and you love it, go to Prey Dog's Patreon and become a Patreon. It is only going to set you back 5 euros, but well, you make sure that they will keep on making this even better. And well, if you are a VR enthusiast, this is truly, truly something that you should do to thank Prey Dog. All right, and that's it for this video. I really hope that you enjoyed it. If yes, give it a thumbs up. And of course, if you've not yet subscribed to MRTV, then absolutely do that now because, well, I will keep you updated about all the exciting things happening in VR. But now I want to hear from you. What are you going to play first with Predox mod? Do let me know down in the comment section of this video. I can't wait to read from you. That's everything I got for this video. I'm looking forward to seeing you in the next one. Until then, bye-bye.